We begin with that developing news. It happened in the East Bay, a shooting involving police that has several streets blocked off. It happened in Danville on Sycamore Valley Road, not far from Interstate 680, just around noontime. KTV's Henry Lee has been monitoring well, that situation. He's joining us live now with the latest details. Well, Christina, we're still trying to figure out what led up to the shooting and the condition of the man who was shot. But this did happen minutes after many people called police to say that a man was throwing rocks at cars on the freeway. A man was shot and wounded by Danville police during a confrontation at a busy street corner. It happened just after noon near Sycamore Valley Road and Camino Ramon. Minutes before the shooting, police responded to calls that a man was throwing rocks at cars on 680 from the overpass. It was not clear what led up to the shooting. The man who was shot was taken to John Muir Medical Center in Walnut Creek. Police have not said whether the injured man was in fact the one reportedly throwing rocks at cars. But law enforcement is well aware of the dangers. Officers have responded to several reports of objects being thrown at cars in Contra Costa County over the past year. A nurse suffered an eye injury after a rock the size of a grapefruit crashed through her windshield in Concord two days before Christmas. In April, a 63-year-old grandmother from Antioch was killed when someone threw a brick. After Thursday's shooting, law enforcement from across Contra Costa County responded. Danville police are part of the sheriff's office. Now, the scene has since cleared. Streets in this area have since reopened. This is the second major police activity in Danville in as many days. Just yesterday, a man experiencing a mental health crisis held police at bay for four hours. As soon as we get more information about today's shooting, we will bring it to you. Reporting live, Henry Lee, KTVU, Fox 2 News. Henry, thank you.